Hey everybody, Patton here. In this video I'm going to show you how to play Game Boy and Game Boy Color games on your mini system. A quick recap on how to mod your system. First thing you want to do in Hack CE is go to the Kernel tab and click Install Repair. Click Yes on the next pop-up. Plug your system into your PC. Hold down Reset and Power On. Hack G will do the rest. Once you have a green light in the bottom left corner, you're all set. If you need further instructions on how to get that done, I'll have my tutorial video in the description below. No BIOS is needed for these games, they're actually really easy to get going. First step is to go to the Modules tab and to the KMFD Mod Hub. Go to the KMFD RetroArc tab, select your version of RetroArc, click Download Module. Next go to the KMFD Cores tab, scroll down to the Nintendo Systems, and you'll see we have three cores to choose from Gambat, Gear Boy, and TGB Dual. I prefer Gambat personally, so you're going to highlight whichever core you want, and again, download module. Close out the mod hub, go back to your modules tab, and install extra modules. Put a check mark next to the core that you chose, and RetroArc. Click OK at the bottom. Once everything's done installing, you should get this done message. The games we're adding are Pokemon Yellow and Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. Highlight your games, drag them directly into Hakchi. You can see Hakchi already populated the box art, spine, and description for us. It also gave us the correct command line. Last step is to hit the synchronize selected games with mini button down at the bottom or export to USB if you're using external storage. We're all set here let's jump on the Genesis Mini and take a look. And here we are this is nice even though the box art doesn't fit the right dimensions of the Genesis games they still look really nice on here. Let's check out Pokemon first. Looks like it started up just fine. Oh yeah we're good to go. And now the Legend of Zelda. Looks like we're good to go. And that's all there is to it. Remember, if you're having any issues with this, you can go to the Rock and the Classics Discord server or subreddit for help. And that's all I got for you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.